I'm Harrison Lynch, Director of Merchandising here at Let's Talk.com. We, uh, we were the first online retailer of cell phones, uh, basically in the U.S. Um, we sell uh, phones and um, plans under contract from Verizon, Sprint, and T-Mobile. We used to keep new phones that were launching, um, and the uh, ordering quantities and, and the directives for our purchasing group on a Google document and it was various forms of chaos because um, just the nature of it was a rolling spreadsheet and you'd have things that were ordered months and months ago and then someone wouldn't delete them and well you weren't sure should you delete them or should you just cross them out or should you have them drop to the bottom and um, it became completely unwieldy and so we've now created all that all in an app and just the way that integrates with the calendar and um, the information and how you can have the filter preloaded so that it always puts what's newest at the top and um, just the ability for now anybody else to go in there at any time and see what phones are coming and is it a, is the phone a big deal and tell me something about it and then how does it relate to any any promotions you're going to have built or any creative you need on the site and that's all tied together and before that was, this was in bunches of different Google Docs that didn't even talk to each other and no one was ever sure what exactly was going on so uh, people would come in late to a conversation and need to get caught up there might be a document that was on an email at one point and then fell off in, in terms of forward or reply. Um, in addition, we have the, the issue of being in two locations. So the biggest pain point uh, for my team especially is that we would have uh, promotions running where a carrier or uh, a manufacturer were sponsoring them and our finance group would not be aware of it. So they wouldn't know that they were expected to accrue the amount or bill it. And so what Podio has done for us is given us a way that we can capture these things in a central place, have a conversation about them, and also have all the relevant documents already stored there. Um, I used to work at an investment bank and on the, the sales trading floor, they had squawk boxes where um, these guys could listen in on what's going on on the floor and be in tune with what's happening. You know, um, I assume it was back in, in New York on Wall Street. And I always, uh, I always thought that I wanted something like that for certain elements of our sales group that they could almost listen into our conversation so they could stay aware of it. And that's what I'm finding is the activity stream is starting to become a little bit of like a, um, a visual uh, squawk box in that they're, they're tuned in to what we're doing and what's going on and what we're talking about without necessarily us having to CC them on every single email we're sending. As we've started to push it down into our various teams is to see people on our teams, the um, at a certain point the light goes on and they realize what they can do with it and you start to see them building their own apps and, and uh, spaces and it's great because it, it really does drive creativity and uh, a lot of um, uh, a lot of time saving. You can see people start to think about how does um, how to make themselves more productive or um, basically or even in their own self-interest how to cut down on the busy work for themselves by putting things into uh, how we have Podio set up.